good morning on this beautiful sunny Monday morning here in Winnipeg. Yep, it's nice out there this morning. And we did have a nice sunrise this morning. Not the best we've had, but nice. I'll run it ahead at about a hundred times speed. So uh, we'll get through it in about 30 seconds. <laughs> okay, it seems to me that at the end of yesterday's episode, I said something to the effect of, we'll be seeing you back here with the, with the spider uh, on the photo etch. But I had forgotten that I had not put these, uh, these vent pipes along the side of the funnel. And there's a total of five of them all together. Now, I, <clears throat> I was looking at the uh, manual here, and it almost appears that one of these pipes has to go through the, one of the platforms. Oh yeah, there, there is holes there. They, they, don't look, they don't look big enough, but uh, there, there is holes in, in the platforms. Uh, okay, I, you know, it's funny, I, I, I never noticed that until just now. Because when I was looking at the manual, I thought, there's no holes in the platforms. <laughs> okay, why do I have the decals out here? Well, it's to, to remind me that I had mentioned to one of the viewers that, that in yesterday's episode, I was going to check uh, to see if the you know on the front of the superstructure where the conning tower is and the bridge and all the rest of it and there was that that little crest of the rodney that we painted red well he thought that possibly that was a a, a decal but but uh, checking the the decals here um uh, it's it's not there so uh we're just going to have to uh uh, you know, just leave it painted red. Now, one of the, another viewer su suggested that possibly that crest was removable. And that makes a lot of sense because if you're going to be going into battle, you don't want anything that's going to, you know, give your location away. And uh, now, mind you, I think if you were, if you were close enough that you could see that crest, you're going to see the whole ship. But you don't want anything that's going to reflect light. And that's why in my, my build of the Rodney, I'm using a lot of colors and stuff like that that, you know, they're, they're just not camouflage if you know what I mean. Uh, in real life, they wouldn't use that. Um, but anyway, let, let's, let's get on here. We'll, we'll have to uh, do our photo etch. I don't think we're going to get at it now. Well, we might. We'll see how things go today. Let's see how things go. Oh, about the uh, about the uh, family get together yesterday. It was really nice. We hadn't been all together like that for well since before the COVID nineteen restrictions, uh, you know, set in, uh, and uh, so so it was really nice to get together. Uh, unfortunately, I got into the taco chips. And I do not need the extra salt and calories and stuff like that. And uh, I put on a little bit of weight yesterday. <laughs> so I got to be extra good today. Anyway, let's, let's uh, see what we can do with these pipes. Uh, they shouldn't be too hard to put on, I, I wouldn't think, unless I have to drill the holes bigger, because those holes do look a little bit on the small side to me. i got to remember now, when I grab this thing, I don't want to be bending that, those, these little, uh, yeah, you know, I, I never did check to see how are they going to match up with the deck when we put it down. They They seem to be they, maybe they go down on top of something. Well, I guess we'll find out when we go to mount the funnel. I guess this will be one of the uh, one of the modules that will be sticking down towards the end of the build after uh, everything else is stuck together. Um, anyway, let's. Uh, oh, one more thing. Uh, this morning I was I was working at my my computer and I I, I don't use a laptop. I have a uh, 
a regular desktop computer and, and the keyboard is separate, to, you know, you know how they are. So anyway, I'm, I'm noticing that off the bottom of the keyboard, one, one, of these, one of these rubber feet came off and I was going to stick it back on. And then I was looking at it and I was thinking, this is the exact kind of rubber that I need for when I'm rolling, when, when I'm going to be rolling the the uh, spider here to get the, get curvature in the in the legs of the spider or, or whatever these things are, and they're not really legs. Um, anyway, yeah. So uh, I'll, it's sticky on this thing is sticky on one side, so I can stick it down on on a my piece of plexiglass and and then roll it with the, with the uh, with the drill bit. You know, it'll 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 stay in place. At least that's the plan. Anyway, enough chatter here. Uh, the, oh, there's no rollback. I was, I was about to say let's roll back, but there's no rollback. I did not come back to the model table yesterday. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, let's, let's just sort of uh, recompose here and uh, put some of these pipes in place. Maybe we'll start with the, with the lowest number. I don't, I don't think it makes any difference. Okay, the C3 is this one that shows it's got a, it's a little bit bent. Okay, the C5, it's the one on this side, so it, it obviously goes in this hole. So C3 must go in this other hole. And, uh, okay, clearly it has to go with the, uh, with the vent pointed out, if you know what I mean. Um, I'll just move this out of the way here. And uh, maybe we'll move in a little bit here. All right, so it's about as close as I can get without using the macro lens. Give myself a little bit of support. Now that, that seems to want to fit in there nicely. I think that's just about right. Now I imagine what we'll do is we'll we'll lock it in place. Just put a little, you know what? I think I could probably use the quick setting. Where is it? There we go. Oh, for goodness sakes. No, I, no, I can't grab hold of it here. Okay, we'll try that again. Does that look like it's about right? I, I think so. I think that this this vent at the top that I'm just touching right now give it a little bit of a twist here. Now that the quick setting it it does where the plastic you know touches together, it seems to really glue that quickly. Uh, somebody made the comment you could build one of these models in a few days if you use nothing but the quick setting. Well, you could, <laughs> unless, unless, as I've said before, you tried to video it.
Now, I think if we just fasten these at the top, um, they, they look they look pretty well straight up and down to me. And uh, okay, does it look like like this one's touching? Yeah. Maybe this one should come out just a little bit here. Okay, C10, Now, I have not tried this yet, so you're going to see it along with me for the first time. Am I going to have to drill that hole out? Or maybe do a better job of scraping off my flashing? Um, C11. Move in a little bit here. Now I know that there's going to be people saying, well, Ron, there shouldn't be any flashing to scrape off. You should have done that. Okay, now this has to go... Yeah, that's a, it just sort of fell in the right, at the right angle. Um, okay, I, I want it so it's sort of parallel with the side of the... Being, being as it's fastened right here... I don't think we need to try and glue it against the side of the funnel. It's sort of going to spoil the detail. So we'll just, just put a little bit right in here. Let that meld really good. Now, I hope I'm not getting my hands in your way here. Probably am. I'm gonna just let it run down the pipe. There. That, that should meld really good. Now, I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and quickly do the same thing, mirror image on the other side here. 
Okay, now on the opposite side goes C6. Now I know I said I was going to just quickly do it, but I was checking my monitor and I realized that you couldn't really see the bottom very well. Yeah, you saw this hole that I'm working on right now. Maybe I need a different tweezer here. Or maybe not. Okay. I think that's uh, pretty much seated. Okay, that's it for the pipes. Okay. As near as I can see, there is nothing left to do in step 28. Step 29, we are officially in it. We are officially starting the spider. And I was looking at this thing a little while ago and I was just trying to think where are these uh, arms of the spider or legs of the spider supposed to fasten onto this ring. Now I, I know you're too far back and you can't really see, but uh, we will put on the macro lens. But we'll be doing that in tomorrow's episode. I, uh, I want to uh, do other things this afternoon. I will likely come at this this evening and I will probably have a roll back tomorrow. Uh, we will, all being well, be using our little piece of rubber. And, um, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. And all being well, we'll be seeing you tomorrow.